I'm very pleased to be here to celebrate the 35th anniversary of this wonderful, vibrant and growing parish. Particularly today, we had lots of baptisms, confirmations that shows that the Spirit is drawing people. God bless you. Gamma 所有中华寻道圣人堂的兄弟姐妹们与第一批这个借套的第一批的长辈们啊兄弟姐妹们呃他们的付出才有了我们的今天他们在铁套上也为我们在祈祷啊同时也特别的感谢所有的兄弟姐妹们每一个三坏的兄弟姐妹们呃
Amen. And with your spirit. Pleasure to be here on the feast of this parish and to confirm and baptize so many who are going to be the new apostles. We are offering them the promise of eternal life at this Mass. Powerful moment for us to be together. An awesome moment for us to remember what it means to be a Christian, to follow Jesus as a parish. My brothers and sisters, let us acknowledge our sins and so to prepare ourselves to celebrate the sacred mysteries. I confess to Almighty God, God and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thought, in my words, in what I have done, in what I have failed to do, through my thoughts, through my fault, through my most gracious fault. Therefore, I ask Blessed Mary, ever virgin, and all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen.
O oh God, who in your wonderful providence have strengthened your church through the confession of the Chinese martyrs, grant that your people, faithful to the mission entrusted to it, may enjoy ever greater freedom and witness to the truth before the world. Through Christ our Lord, your Son, who lives and reigns with the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. Please be seated. 智慧篇，一人的灵魂在天主手里，任何痛苦不能伤害他们。在愚人看来，他们好像是死了，认为他们去世是一种灾祸。他我们离我们而去，仿佛是归于泯灭，但他们却处于安宁中。在人看来，他们是受了惩罚，但他们却充满着远生的希望。他们受了些些许的痛苦，却要接受绝大的恩惠。天主考验了他们，挖掘他们配做他的人，他试炼了他们，好像炉中的黄金。悦纳了他们，犹如存方剂。他们猛眷顾时，将闪烁花光，犹如麦禾间往来飞驰的火花。他们要指挥万国，统治万民。上主要远远做他们的君王。于是，上主的人必明白真理，忠信的人必与他同住在爱内，因为他的特神者必获得恩泽与仁慈。上主的话，感谢天主。赞美上主，我的口不断赞颂上主，我的心灵因上主而自豪。谦卑了的人听了，也必翻阅。扬上主，让我们齐声颂扬他的名号。我寻求了上主，他就应允了我，他救我脱离了一切恐惧。你们扬赞他，就会喜形于色，绝不至满面羞惭。困苦的人一呼求，上主立刻抚允，拯救他脱离一切艰辛。
在那敬畏上主的人世中，有上主的天使扎营护守，请你们体验并观看，上主是何等的美善，投奔他的人真是有福。是希伯来人说：弟兄姊妹们，圣人圣女们都借着信德征服了列国，执行正义，得到恩许。他们堵住狮子的口，破灭了烈火，逃出了利剑。他们转软弱为刚强。成为战争中的英雄，击溃爱国的军队。有些妇女得了他们从死里复活的人，有些人宁愿受酷刑敲打，而不愿接受释放，为获得更美好的复活。另有些人。遭受了凌辱和鞭打，甚至捆绑和监禁。有些人被石头砸死，被锯死，被敲门，被利剑杀死。再有些人披着绵羊、山羊皮，到处流浪，忍受。贫乏、迫害和虐待，世界不值得他们居留。他们就在旷野、山岭间流浪，在山洞和地狱中栖身。上主的话，感谢天主。请起立，我哋一齐迎接基督嘅福音。Are insulted for the name of Christ. Blessed are you, for the Spirit of God rests upon you. Jesus came down with the twelve and stood on the level place with a great crowd of his disciples and a great multitude of people from all Judea, Jerusalem, and the coast of Tyre and Sidon. 
They had come to hear him and to be healed of their disease. And those who were troubled with unclean spirits were cured. And all in the crowd were trying to touch him, for power came out from him and healed all of them. Then Jesus looked up at his disciples and said, "Blessed are you who are poor, for yours is the kingdom of God. Blessed are you who hunger now, for you will be filled. Blessed are you who weep now, for you will laugh. Blessed are you." When people hate you, when they exclude you, revile you, and defame you on account of the Son of Man, rejoice in that day and leap for joy, for surely your reward is great in heaven. For that is what their ancestors did to the prophets. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Jesus was speaking to his disciples in our gospel. He was speaking to me and to you. In Saint Luke's gospel, it says Jesus came down on a level ground. He was looking eye to eye with his disciples. He wanted to be with his disciples. He wanted his disciples to be with him. He came down from the mountain and he looked them in the eye, and he spoke to them. That's very, very important. Jesus wants to be with us, and he came as our brother, although still God, to be with us. And how are we with him? By faith, we listen and we respond to the way of Jesus, as He laid out in the Gospel today. And we are baptized when we hear the message of Jesus. The Spirit of God will draw us into being baptized. And when we're baptized, as you'll see in a few moments, when the wa water is poured over the head of those to be baptized, everything changes. Then, a new birth, a new person in Jesus happens. That's what's going to happen at the baptismal font for so many this afternoon. A new person. Born again in Jesus, and Jesus will be in their heart forever, and they will be part of Jesus forever. That makes us Christian in Christ, Christ in Christian. So, from the moment of our baptism, when God, the Almighty Father, looks into our hearts. And that's the only place he really looks. He really doesn't care how tall we are, how smart we are, how rich we are. But he looks into our hearts. He sees Jesus. When we are baptized, we see Jesus in us, and that's why he loves us like a daughter, like a son. Only Christians are the sons and daughters of God, because only Christians are baptized in Jesus, the Son of God. It's very important. That's why God loves us so much. That's why Jesus came to meet us eye to eye, to invite us into His life, so that we can live with Him in Him now and forever in heaven. When we assemble like this, but in the heavenly Jerusalem, in the heavenly temple, to worship God face to face, to see Jesus face to face. So that the presence of Jesus is more deep in our hearts, 
the Holy Spirit will come upon those who are to be confirmed tonight. Confirmation is the deepening of that image of Jesus because they are anointed with the chrism oil, which is for the mission. So they can be more like Christ. So when the Father looks into our hearts after confirmation, he sees not just Jesus, but the anointed Jesus, the one anointed for the mission, the mission of making Jesus present in the world and the justice of God present in the world. So that when we have lies, we, can tell, we will tell the truth. And when we encounter darkness, we'll bring light. When people are afraid, we'll bring support and encouragement. And where there's violence, we'll bring peace. All because we are missioned with Christ. In Christ. The chrism oil comes from the same word as Christ which means the anointed one. So when you, when you are confirmed, you are anointed like Jesus was for the mission. Think of it. All of us who are already confirmed, we are anointed for the mission. <coughs> the mission. We have the power of the Holy Spirit forever in our hearts. Anytime we need that power, to do good, avoid evil, make decisions. That spirit is with us, the spirit of Jesus. That's the most important thing about a parish community. It starts in our baptism and our confirmation. And everything we do in a parish, every organization, every group, every activity builds on our relationship that we have with Jesus as his brothers and sisters and with the Father as his sons and daughters. Everything we do begins there and will lead us ultimately, we pray, to eternal life. So think of that. We have a run of some, lots of ceremony this afternoon. Think about that when you see them being baptized. Remember, you are baptized. What does that mean to you? When they're being confirmed, you are confirmed. What does that mean to you? very important that we focus on what God is acting right now. Sometimes during COVID, we wonder, did, did God abandon us? Maybe we felt that. We were desperate, alone. Things didn't seem to be getting better. But now we know God loves us. Now we know this is a sign. God is acting. All these people, God has brought them to Jesus. And at the end of the Mass, we will acknowledge those who in Jesus have been married and carry on that mission of making Jesus present to each other, to their children, and to the world. So it's a wonderful way to celebrate a parish because everything begins and has its meaning in what we're doing this afternoon.谢谢主教我简单的用中文告诉大家刚才主教讲了什么那主教讲说今天我们听到今天的福音听到福音呢我们第一句听到说主耶稣从山上下来然后站在一个平地上他就讲到站在这个平地上那接下来呢主教讲
，说主耶稣从这个时候进入我们的生命，来到我们的心中，说从这个时候开始，我们可以在主耶稣内称天主是我们的父亲。没有其他的人在这个世界上能够这么亲密的称天主是自己的父亲，可是我们基督徒可以，因为我们在主耶稣内成了天主的儿女，成了天主的儿女，与主耶稣来到我们心中。那为什么这件事情很重要呢？因为从这一个时刻开始，主教说，当他把水啊三次浇在你的头上，呃，因父及子及圣神之名给你复洗的那个时刻开始。从那个时刻开始，你成了一个新的人，成了一个新的人，全新的人。以前的一切，你所做的一切，所犯的一切的罪，都得到了赦免，因为在主耶稣内，你成了一个新的人，成了一个天主所爱的子女。啊，这个非常的重要，这是主要讲的这个第一个啊，我们灵洗了。他说：“灵洗以后呢，我们要在主耶稣内成长。所以主耶稣来到我们心中。他说，主耶稣永远也不会抛弃我们。主耶稣来到我们心中，永远在我们心里面。但是我们要成长，要成长。那怎么样成长呢？接下来我们今天领完洗以后，主教还会给我们领受这个坚正圣事。坚正圣事是主教把这个圣油。”附在我们的头上，附在我们的头上。那为什么要附在我们的头上？我们都记得是说，当我们一个人腐油的时候，啊，圣经里面你们如果读到知道说，腐油往往是跟使命连在一起的，啊，天主要派遣你去做什么重要的事情。所以呢，你领受捐赠的时候，你的额上啊，领受了这个圣油腐油以后，你是有使命的。是有使命的，天主派遣你来到这个世界上，你有一个基督徒的使命，去度一个基督徒的生活。啊，今天我们在这是天主的这个，我们是圣人堂，有很多的天主的圣人和我们在一起。那我们知道说，当我们度一个基督徒的生活的时候，我们会面对许多的困难。今天的读经里面，我们也听到主教也特别的讲到，讲到这个字，他用的是叫 turbulence。Turbulence， 就是说呢，我们灵洗以后会面临许多的困难。度一个基督徒的生活需要面对困难，那怎么办呢？有圣神和我们在一起，圣神在我们的心中，让我们提醒我们，同时给我们能力去度一个基督徒的生活。所以今天我们灵洗，我们领受捐赠，那不光是今天灵洗和领受捐赠的弟兄姐妹。同时，也提醒我们所有已经领过洗、领过见证的我们的弟兄姐妹，知道是说天主爱我们，主耶稣在我们的心中，圣神在我们的心中，使我们有能力在每一天的生活里面去度一个基督徒的生活。我们今天是一个教会、一个教堂里面，所有的人，我们在一个教堂里面所做的所有的事情。都围绕着这一件事情，什么事情呢？因着我们领洗和领受捐赠这个盛世，我们度一个基督徒的生活。天主爱我们。好，谢谢大家。我哋而家系会开始入门圣事，各位请起立。We are going to have a celebration of the baptism for adults. Dear friends, let us pray to Almighty God for our brothers and sisters who are asking for baptism. He has called them. And brought them to this moment. May He grant them light and strength to follow Christ with resolute hearts and to profess the faith of the Church. May He give them the new life of the Holy Spirit, whom they are about, whom we are about to call down upon the waters of this baptism. The Litany of the Saint.
生只靠你水力。靠你水灵，基督靠你水灵，主靠你水灵，主靠你水灵，天主之母圣玛利亚。主圣天使，主为我们祈祷，圣约翰世者，主为我们祈祷，圣约瑟，主为我们祈祷，圣巴多禄及圣保禄。求圣约望，请为我们祈祷。圣玛利亚·马达拉拉，请为我们祈祷。圣史达望，请为我们祈祷。圣以拉爵。圣巴尔杜亚及圣腓利奇，请为我们祈祷。圣以利士，请为我们祈祷。圣阿奥略及圣奥斯丁，请为我们祈。圣阿大纳苏及圣巴西略，请为我们祈祷。圣马尔丁及圣本多，请为我们祈祷。圣方济及圣多明，请为我们祈。圣方济各撒玛略，请为我们祈祷。圣约翰怀阿拉，请为我们祈祷。圣加大利拉，请为我们祈祷。圣女小达拉。圣和阿拉，请为我们祈祷。圣像大盼，请为我们祈祷。众话诸位真福及圣人，请为我们祈祷。天上诸位圣人，请为我们祈。望住衰年，高处请救我们；从一切灾祸中，高处请救我们；从罪恶中，高处请救我们；从永死中，高处请救我。因主降神圣人的奥谢，救主拯救我们；因主的圣死与复活，救主拯救我们；因圣神的降临，救主拯救我们；我们罪人。
靠住管理和保存他的圣教会。靠住保护教宗及教会各级圣职恩怨，靠住父的我，靠住赐全人类和向和平与真正的和谐，靠住父的我，靠住激励我们圣心是风塔。靠住以恩宠，祝圣者赐恩身神的水。靠住父的我，靠住直圣世圣师，赐给这些得算者再生的恩宠。靠住父的我，耶稣神活天主之子。基督，求你扶停我们。基督，求你扶停我们。基督，求你垂怜我们。基督，求你垂怜我们。而家神，而家主教会祝圣、祝圣、祝福嘅圣嘅水。They pray over the water. Father, you give us grace through the sacramental signs, which tell us of the wonders of your unseen power. In baptism, we use the gift of water, which you have made a rich symbol of the grace you give us in this sacrament. At the very dawn of creation, your Spirit. Breathed on the waters, making them the wellspring of all holiness. The waters of the great flood, you made a sign of waters of baptism, that make an end of sin and a new beginning of goodness. <coughs> Through the waters of the Red Sea, you led Israel out of slavery to be an image of God's holy people, set free from the, by, from sin by baptism. In the waters of the Jordan. Your son was baptized by John and anointed with the Spirit. Your son willed that the water and blood would flow from his side as he hung upon the cross. After his resurrection, he told his disciples, "Go out and teach all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit." Father, look now with love upon your church and unseal for her the foundation of baptism. By the power of the Holy Spirit, give to the waters the grace of your Son, so that in the sacrament of baptism, all those whom you have created in your own likeness may be cleansed from sin and rise to a new birth of innocence by water and the Holy Spirit. We ask you, Father, with your Son, send your Holy Spirit upon the waters of this font. May all who have been buried with Christ in the death of baptism rise also with Him to newness in life. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Now, we all together with the dead and the resurrection of sin. Those of you to be baptized, we need to hear your answer. Good, loud voice, so everybody in the church can hear you. So I ask you: Do you reject sin so as to live in the freedom of the children of God? I do. Do you reject the glamour of evil and refuse to be mastered by sin? I do. Do you reject Satan, the father of sin, and the prince of darkness? I do. Do you believe in God, the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth? I do. Do you believe in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord, who was born of the Virgin Mary, suffered death, and was buried, 
rose again from the dead and is seated at the right hand of the Father? I do. Do you believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting? I do. 教会为儿童领洗后之后后来是富有的请你们的婴孩父母和受洗后的婴孩一起起立请婴孩跟父母跟受洗后的婴儿的儿童一起起立God of power, Father of our Lord Jesus Christ has freed you from sin and brought you to new life through water and the Holy Spirit he now anoints you with the chrism of salvation so that united with his people you may remain forever a member of Christ who is priest, prophet, and king. Now we are clothing with a baptism, the baptismal garment. My dear friends, you have become a new creation and clothed yourself in Christ. Receive in the white garment and bring it unstained to the judgment seat of our Lord Jesus Christ that you may have everlasting life. Amen. Amen. God, parents, please come forward to give the newly baptized the light of Christ. You have been enlightened by Christ walk always as children of the light and keep the flame of faith alive in your hearts when the Lord comes you may go out to meet him with all the saints in the heavenly kingdom Amen Amen 现在已经是建立了新的基督徒我们入天主教仪式 now is the rite of reception of the baptized Christian into the full communion of the Catholic Church. Of your own free will, you've asked to be received in full communion with the Catholic Church. You have made your decision after careful thought and under the guidance of the Holy Spirit. I now invite you to come forward with your sponsor and in the presence of this community profess your Catholic faith. In this faith, you will be one with us for the first time at the Eucharistic table of our Lord Jesus, the sign of unity. The Lord receives you into the Catholic Church. His loving kindness has led you here so that in the unity of the Holy Spirit you may have full communion with us in the faith that you have professed in the presence of his family. Amen. Celebration of the confirmation. My, my dear nearly baptized and young people. You have been born again in, by, in Christ by baptism. You have become members of, the, of Christ and of his priestly people. Now you are to share in the outpouring of the Holy Spirit among us, the Spirit sent by the Lord upon his apostles at Pentecost and given by them and their successors to the baptized. The promised strength of the Holy Spirit, the promised strength of the Holy Spirit which you are to receive will make you more like Christ and help you to be witnesses to his suffering, death, and resurrection. It will strengthen you to be active members of the church and to build up the body of Christ in faith and love. 
My dear friends, let us pray to God our Father that he will pour out the Holy Spirit upon these newly baptized and young people to strengthen them with his gifts and anoint them to be more like Christ, the Son of God. All-powerful God, Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, by water and the Holy Spirit, you freed your sons and daughters from sin and gave them new life. Send your Holy Spirit upon them to be their helper and guide. Give them the spirit of wisdom and understanding, the spirit of right judgment and courage, the spirit of knowledge and fear of the Lord. Fill them with the spirit of wonder and awe in your presence. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Please be seated. Right now, we are going to have the untaunting with chrism. Joseph, Shenjiao,我请,我请新的教友,可能所有的刚才领,富有见证的,所有的朋友,请起立。So,请所有三教友,同埋刚才,刚刚领着富有见证的,请起立。Please all the... Like all of us have put on Christ and become the children of God. They have joined us to lead a new life in the Holy Spirit. Let us praise the Lord for the wonders revealed in them and welcome them to the church. Pray of the faithful. We are all gathered here, dear brothers and sisters, to celebrate the mysteries of our redemption. Let us therefore ask Almighty God that the whole world may be, wa may be watered through these springs of all blessings and life. Kaujifutin 常怀着哀主爱人的心for those who are suffering oppressions, that they may find the consolation and support they need, let us pray to the Lord. For granting all the parishioners as a joyful outcome to our prayers, so that we may imitate the Chinese martyr saints and our motto, and live fully the life of a Christian, so that one day we could join them in heaven and have eternal life. Let us pray to the Lord. May your mercy, we beseech you, O Lord, be with your people who cry to you, so that what they seek at your prompting they may obtain at your ready generosity. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Please be seated.
Pray, my brothers and sisters. <clears throat> that my sacrifice and yours be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. 
May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands, and may you please accept the Almighty God. As we venerate the passion of your Chinese martyrs, grant that through this sacrifice, O Lord, we may proclaim worthily the death of your only begotten Son, who, not content with encouraging the martyrs by word, strengthened them likewise by example, who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God. For the blood of your blessed Chinese martyrs, poured out like Christ to glory your name, shows forth your marvelous works, by which in our weakness you perfect your power, and on the feeble bestow strength to bear you witness through Christ our Lord. And so with all the powers of heaven, we worship you constantly on earth and before your majesty without end, we acclaim. we pray, by sending down your spirit upon them like the dewfall, so they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks, broke it and gave it to his disciples saying, take this all of you and eat of it, for this is my body which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples saying, take this all of you and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks as you've held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with Francis, our Pope, and Thomas, our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with blessed Joseph, her spouse, with the blessed apostles and with all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, 
in the unity of the Holy Spirit. All glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Please rise. At the Savior's command, informed by divine teaching, we dare to say. from every evil, graciously grant peace in our days that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all evil as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Please kneel, Ching Guisha. Behold the Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, Lord I am not Lord, worthy Lord. that you should enter under my roof but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed.
Let us pray. Having fed upon heavenly delights, we humbly ask you, O Lord, that by the example of the Chinese martyrs, we, bear, we may bear in our hearts the marks of your son's charity and suffering, and ever enjoy the fruit of perpetual peace through Christ our Lord. Amen. St. Michael, the Archangel Prayer. St. Michael, the Archangels, defend us in these days of battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and the snails of devil. May God rebuke him with humble prayer. And do thou, O Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, throw into hell Satan and all the evil spirits who prowl about the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. So please be seated right now. We are going to blessing the wedding anniversaries. We Lord, God and Creator, we bless and praise you. In the beginning you made man and woman so they might enter a communion of life and love. You likewise protected the union of these couples before him, so that they might reflect the union of Christ with his church. Look with kindness on them today, amid the joys and struggles of their life. You have preserved the union between them. Renew their marriage covenant, increase your love in them, and strengthen their bond of peace, so that, surrounded by your children and grandchildren, they may always rejoice in the gift of your blessing. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Your Excellency, on behalf of our parish, I thank you for joining us today for the celebration of the 30th, 50th uh, parishional anniversary. We are very honored to have you here today. Please welcome and thank you, Bishop Bosso. I also want to thank you all you are for making this celebration of very special and uh, great giving events. Hallelujah. Thank you, Tianji. 特别感谢天主
而家到而家，我哋都可以睇到教育，睇到我哋常规发展嘅过程当中，都占到一个好重要的位置。中华新道圣人堂呢，能够有走到今日第三十五个周年，都看来教育同义工嘅支持和鼓励，特别系疫情期间。我的教友对我的支持尤其好珍贵的，我仅代表唐奎所有的神父和修女和各位教友，唐奎议会历届的同各义工，只是深深的感激。中华新道圣人堂将来的发展都全来你的个，我的掌声、互相鼓励、彼此鼓励，多谢你的啊！多谢多谢。在娘来借你慈悲，圣母玛利亚从中华宣道圣人的带头，同各位教友的支持，我的修会要和小生代一起，也会一定会踏进自己该做牧养我的中华宣道圣人堂，祈愿我的为我的爱天主跟爱，并深恒天主的旨意，感恩。无论我的口沫呀，天赋呢，一定会干乎我的干，天主保佑。So for those of you who were baptized, those of you who were baptized and confirmed, those of you who were baptized, those of you who were confirmed, it's not over. It's just the beginning. <laughs> They're just beginning to be an anointed Christian. Remember that. You can trust on the support of your parishioners here. You are now a full member of this church. And these are your brothers and sisters who journeyed with you and are willing to support and encourage them just as they want you, even you young people, to share your gifts with them. So we're just beginning the journey. We don't know what the Lord has planned for us, but we know it's going to be peaceful and joyful, and where we belong. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. Bow down for the blessing. The Lord God has given us this special day to rejoice together with the martyrs of China. May he bless you and protect you through their intercession. May the Lord help you to become one body and live out your mission by following the example of the martyrs. Inspire you with His Word, nourish you with His sacraments, that you may always be able to witness to the gospel. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit.